In this problem, we want to take the square root of p to the 15th and simplify it. Solution. So because we're trying to take the square root, we need to take this p to the 15 and write it as something squared. So the way to do that is to just carefully think um, about the number 15. So no matter what, we're going to have p to some number squared. And so we just need to figure out what this number is. So you can use lots of numbers, but if you think about it carefully, 7 will work. Because if we do p to the 7 squared, you multiply here, and that gives you p to the 14. So the idea is we'll break this up as p to the 14 times p to the 1. And now we can write this first piece as what's called a perfect square. We can write this as p to the 7 squared times p to the 1. And then we can break it up as the square root of p to the 7 squared. And then here we have the square root of p. And the reason we did this is because now the square root will just get rid of the 2. So we have p to the 7 times the square root of p. And that'll be the final answer. So again, whenever you have a square root, you want to think about how you can write this piece as something squared. And so basically, you basically have to come up with something like this. So just think about the possible numbers um, that go here. In this case, 7 would work. 7 times 2 is 14, and that's smaller than 15. If you try to use 8, you would get 16, and so that won't work. I hope this video has been helpful.